eight. I would like to start this video with a question. My question is, what do you think the greatest invention ever made was? Ever. All the way back to the history of time, all the way to right now. When will that was the best invention? Some of you, I know you're probably thinking maybe the light bulb, electricity. Um, I know indoor plumbing. Indoor plumbing is definitely a, uh, a nice invention. I would put that towards the top. Um, you know, think. Think a little bit. Think about it. I'll let you think. What's your, what do you think the greatest invention I ever made was? Think. Okay, now I'm going to give you mine. And I know mine is the best invention ever made. You ready for it? Taco Bell. Taco Bell is the greatest invention ever made. I just went there. Got a quesadilla. It's like... It's like... If you could... If you could take rainbows and flowers and all that's good in the world, wrap it inside a tortilla, press it down to heat it for 27 seconds, put some cheese on it, because everything tastes better with cheese on it, you get this. Mm. Oh, I got some... got some jalapeno sauce on my mouse. I think the second greatest invention right behind Taco Bell... God, this is good. Right after Taco Bell would probably be Red Bulls. <clears throat> I love Red Bulls. I know. I hear you. They're bad for your liver. There's a big crash afterwards. Your, you can die. Your heart could explode if you drink too many of them. And that's why I gave them up. I gave up Red Bulls. I love them with a passion. I gave them up and I went without for three whole months. Three months without the second greatest invention ever. Could you live without electricity for three months? Anyways, so I'm driving home one day and I'm thinking one Red Bull. One Red Bull will help me get through the rest of this trip and get me home, right? Well, little did I know that giving me a Red Bull is like giving a fat kid a piece of cake. He ain't gonna have just one. You know what I mean? Well, I don't have very long to make a video, so to end it off, I'm gonna show you how my day went. Pretty much a typical day in the life of Steve. First of all, I had to wake up. Which, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm pretty much a morning person. And then, I had to go to work. My job is, well... This is Steve from Quality Smith. No, no, we do not, we do not rent out strippers. Um, or, or a hose. Alright, thanks a lot, bye. Quality Smith, this is Steve. Yes, you did guess that I am wearing green underwear, why? And then, I decided to work out my bulging biceps. I needed to lift some weights, you know, sculpt these guns I got, you know what I'm saying? I'm pretty much, I'm pretty much probably the second or third strongest person in the world. I mean, of course, you have to go, you know, Rocky, number one, right? And number two would probably be Arnold Schwarzenegger. And then Steve, definitely. And then, after that, I came home, and I actually ate a little bit of heaven, wrapped in a tortilla, with meat, and beans, and cheese, and rice. And then after that, I decided to play a little cards to occupy some time. And then, I figured it was bedtime. I got a big day of nothing planned for tomorrow. <laughs>